Hello everyone, it's Andrea, welcome back to the channel. I'm going to do a flip, flip through of this book, it's called Marilyn Mystique, it's an adult colouring book. Now I saw this as a Marilyn fan and book collector, I periodically go onto Amazon on my laptop, put Marilyn Monroe in, put books in and then go new to new, newest arrived or newest published, date, whatever, and go through them. And I was looking through the books just randomly, because sometimes I just do that as well, see what turns up. And this book popped up. So this is called Marilyn Mystique. It's by Tal Creates. Uh, that's the front and then that and the back. And I thought I'd get it. Now, the thing about Marilyn books is they never look like Marilyn. They, I think there was one which I never got, which did. And it's never been reprinted, which is a shame. But let's have a look. So it is dedicated to Norma Jean, which is Marilyn's real name, even though they missed the uh, E off the end. Now, I've already looked through this, and I do like it. I think it's a lovely book, a nice tribute. And just so you're aware, it's called Marilyn Mystique. The pictures don't actually look like Marilyn, but just somebody trying to dress like Marilyn did. And to me, that's fine. That's what Marilyn Mystique is about. So we've got her in a, a horse dress, and another horse dress, because that's what she was pretty famous from, and bathing suits. So the way they've done her hair, they've pre-shaded it. So you could either do her as a blonde or a brunette, because obviously Marion was sort of like a, what they call a dirty blonde. Um, it was sort of more, almost auburn in some lights. Or you could do it blonde. So it depends on the picture. So, well, like I said, while I said it doesn't look like Marilyn, and when we get to sort of a better one, I'll, I'll show you the face. Um but the pictures are really cute. So this one says diamonds are girl's best friend. So if I just zoom it in like that, you can see it doesn't really look like her. There's a slight resemblance, but it's not. And I don't think it's meant to. I think it's more supposed to be like, like they call it the marriage thing. So in this one, she is wearing a kind of copy of the diamonds dress. So we all know how that's gonna go. Shocking pink. A lot of her in bathing suits because of course Marilyn was in bathing suits a lot. This one with the tiki is a bit odd but it is still good and the big um, thing at the back that she's leaning on. So the, the set is only single sided, the other side has just got these funny dots on them which will make your eyes go funny if you're not careful. There's that one. And they haven't even done that right because Marilyn would cross her legs in a very specific way. She would tuck this leg behind this leg. But, um, and then there's this one, another bathing suit. That's a very 40s style bathing suit. Another horse and neck dress. Well, you could do it as a two piece, but it is supposed to be a dress. Now she wore horse neck dresses in all sorts of colours, most notably obviously white, ecru, and also um, red and orange are the most famous colours. And then there was one that was white, that radiated, oh, so there was a grey one, one that white um, at the top but then gradiated into pink at the bottom. I quite like this one with the sunglasses, they're not very 50s sunglasses but they're kind of cute. And again this is the diamonds dress with a scarf which is odd but yeah Marilyn on the moon I'm not actually sure about that one but they're really cute but they just show people a woman who is is dressing in that sort of style Marilyn mystique which I think is kind of cute it, it the pictures are good there's nothing wrong with the artist. The artist can draw, and he could. This artist could probably draw Marion's face on them if they wanted to, but didn't. They've made it look a little bit like her without really making it like her. Again, that's the diamond dress. Not sure about that one with the comedy cow in the background, but there you go. I don't like these backgrounds. I usually black them out. Too busy. I was some like it hot with the seven year inch dress, which obviously isn't from some like it hot, but I've seen that done before. There was a thermometer made that said some like it hot, but had her in that dress. I quite like that one. 
and we've got Marilyn as a hippo and this has been done for years it's not offensive at all it's just we've had Marilyn as a pig Marilyn as a hippo Marilyn as all sorts so the circus one is kind of good of course she did appear at the Barnum and Bailey circus riding on a pink elephant costume wasn't anything like that but she did and again this is kind of like the pink diamond dress I guess kind of like that one I'm not sure about the animals in the background it's kind of weird but who cares that one's good even as you know she's wearing a, a tiger print so there's a tiger in the background that one makes sense oh, that elephant is so cute and again showgirl type costumes the diamond dress again even though the, the bow at the back is a bit floppy riding a bike kind of cute that's kind of nice and that one with a chipmunk horse neck with polka dots Another one with a hippo in it. Another Marion hippo, which is I think they're cute actually. 1920s style, I guess. Professor Culpepper's world famous marching band, apparently. Sometimes I wonder none of this has got anything to do with Marilyn, but again, it's Marilyn Mystique in the fact that how she inspires people over the years which she has that's a nice one and like I said you can colour the the, the horse neck dresses any colour she, you wanted she had them in orange she had them in black she had them in grey she had them in white she had them in red she would find a dress she liked and buy multiple copies in different colours and that is true um, same with Poochie, she had lots of Poochie dresses, the sheath dresses, and she had them in uh, pink and green and orange and purple. It's just the doors said, and that's all the books, and here are some of the books that the artist has. And they go on to explain that you can create your own, but I'm hopeless at drawing, so not me. Anyway, that is the Marilyn Mystique colouring book, let me know what you think about it, it is different. Like I said, it doesn't look like Marilyn, but it gives the essence of somebody trying to dress and get that 50s style look which is great quite like it very cute we'll be colouring in it so hope to see you all again very very soon bye